Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be trying a herbal tea. We're gonna be making, let me rephrase that. We're gonna be making a herbal tea. This tea right here, listen, you're gonna wanna try it. And when you try it, let me know. You can leave it, leave it down in the, the, uh, the comment section below or you can DM me, just let me know after you try this. This is not something you wanna try every day because you don't wanna over exhaust your liver, but this will get you to the bathroom. This will get everything out. So the ingredients you're gonna need today is some honey, you're gonna need some black pepper, you're gonna need some mint. This mint is a little old, it's been a few days, but it's still fresh. You're gonna need, you, this is optional, the lemon is optional. I just wanted more effect, so the lemon is optional. But what you are gonna need is the ginger, you're gonna need turmeric, you're gonna need cinnamon sticks, you're gonna need about two limes, you're gonna need some water. The water I'm trying to, I'm doing, I'm using today. You wanna be careful with the water you use, it's very important. So the water I'm using today is the Aqualine water. This Aqualine water pH balance is 9.5. You want to make sure your pH is balanced. <laughs> and you're going to need about two quarts of water. You're going to need a pot and a, and a stove. And yeah, so we're going to get started. So what we're going to do first, we're going to... First, we're going to cut up our mints. You know, make sure it's nice and thin. You know, I'm no chef, so, you know, my little cutting game ain't like the rest of them. You want to use every part of the, the mint. Every part of the mint every mint smell real good so you're going to use some mint then you want to cut up your ginger this is like i would say about how would y'all say this this is like what two 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 um i don't, I don't really know about measurements let me be honest with y'all i'm just the eye person you know to it, it depends how big you 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 or how small of a portion you make it. But this is like, you could say two gingers. You could say two gingers. You wanna make sure you cut it nice and fine. So I've cut up my ginger. It don't have to be perfect. You know, it does not have to be perfect. So I cut up my ginger. Listen, this right here, this herbal tea, it does the work. You wanna drink this on an empty stomach. I'm cutting up my, my, my turmeric right now, as you can see. You want to drink this on an empty stomach twice a day. As you know, turmeric, ginger, mint, it has its benefits as far as to, you know, helping get rid of all the toxins and fat in your body. You know, so you want to drink this on an empty stomach at least twice a day. This does the works. It does the works. So I've cut up my ginger. I've cut up my lemon. I've cut up my uh, turmeric. I've also, let me get the water going. So you're going to, before I cut the rest or whatever. So this is like about 16 ounce mug. This is what I'll be drinking from as well. I have to get a new mug from my last video. And you want to fill the, you want to fill it up. So this is one. It depends the portion size of your, um, your pot as well. And that's two. But you don't want to, you don't want to put too much water. You don't want to put too much water. But you want to put enough water because you're going to drink this for like two days. You're going to drink it in the morning and in the night. Both You're going to drink it before bed. Make it be the last thing you drink, you know, before your bedtime. And the first thing you drink in the morning. And make sure it's very hot. Because it's, 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 it's something about when it's hot, that's when it really, um, you know, targets all the fat in your, your, your abdominal, your, the fat in your whole area, you know. So I've cut up my lemon, and you're going to put all of this in the pot, everything in the pot. So right now I'm cutting up my lime. You know, it doesn't have to be perfect, you know. It does not have to be perfect. And it don't even have to taste good, too, because you this is a business tea. This is not no sip tea and talk. No, this is a get in my body and do your job tea, you know. It's herbal, you know, but this is a different type of herbal. So right now I'm cutting up my lime, cutting it up, cutting it up, cutting it up. You can use, you can use, e you can use either more of what I have or less or just about the same amount. It depends the size of your pot. It all depends. But you're going to want to try this at least, at least, at least two times a week, at least. Two times being in life, drink one in the morning, one in the night. And then the next day, one in the morning, one in the night. Both on empty stomachs. 
And then that's when you want to do it again next week or so. Yes, baby. My baby came to join me. I don't think she want to say hi right now. But yes, yeah, so this is all the ingredients you're going to need. I have my, my water boiling. It's starting. So, let's review. <laughs> As the water, as the water boils. So you're going to need black pepper. You're going to use like one, one, depending on how big your pot is or how big of a portion you're doing. You're going to use like one spoon of black pepper. You're going to use some honey. You're going to use the honey only in the morning times when you, like, because honey gives you energy. It also helps with the immune system as well. But honey gives you energy, so I'll mainly use the honey in the nighttime. I mean, in the morning time. In the nighttime, you don't need the honey. Honey is optional. Then you're going to need the turmeric. Then you're going to need the ginger. Then you're gonna need the mint, then you're gonna need the lemon, then you're gonna need the lime, then you're gonna need the cinnamon, and then you're gonna need your water. And yeah. So while that while that gets ready to boil and all that good stuff, we just gonna add it in. We adding everything in. We adding everything in. And you're gonna let it, you're gonna let it boil for like five minutes. Five, you know, not five minutes. I said, you're gonna let it, you're gonna let it, you're gonna bring it up to a boil for like 10 15 minutes, depending on how high you have it, basically. So, I'm, I added my turmeric, I added my ginger, I added my mint, I added my lemon, I'm adding my cinnamon stick, I'm adding my lime. The, the benefits of black pepper and weight loss there's so many great benefits look it up you're gonna see black pepper help a lot with um with weight loss a lot so this is the amount of black pepper i'm adding so guys this is how it looks so far it is coming up to a boil it's been in here for like a minute and now you can see the bubbles this is how it looks so far far it's coming up to a boil so i couldn't find i couldn't find a a, 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 a top so we're gonna do it the old caribbean way we're gonna do it you know we're, we're gonna use what we got but you want to make sure that you cover this make sure that it is nice and covered and yeah that's it so you're gonna let that sit for like 10 15 minutes i have it on the highest level which is about i believe it's nine yeah, I have it on nine, and yeah, that's it. So I'll be back to show you how it's supposed to look. So let it sit for, let it boil up to like 10 15 minutes, and yeah, I'll be back after that. Okay, guys, so this I'm gonna show you how it looks after it's been it's been boiling for about 15 minutes now. I'm gonna show you how it looks. This is all the herbs. This is how it looks. So right now I'm gonna turn off the stove because as you can see by the color of the water, you know, it's all in there. It's all in there. So this is how you want the color of your water to look. You know, like green, green. This, you know, this is the lime. As you can see, I don't know if you can tell which one is the lime. But yeah, this is the lime. This is the color you really want it to be. And yeah. This is a natural herbal tea that would definitely make you use the restroom. You can add apple cider vinegar, not in this, you know, in your own cup. You can add apple cider vinegar to make it more effective. It is an optional ingredient. But yes, this is this. So I'm going to turn down the stove. Actually, I'm going to turn it off. Yeah, just turn it off. And then let this cool down, you know. And I'm going to show you how it's to be served. It smells really good. Very, very, very good. And yeah, that's it. So I'll be back to show you how it's to be served. Hi guys, so I'm back. 
I just want to show you how it is to be how you can how you can uh, drink it. You have two options. You can drink it hot or you can drink it cold. Me, I like to drink mine hot. So what I but I like to I don't like to keep it in a pot. So what I like to do, you have the option if you like to choose if you like to add apple cider vinegar. I, I prefer to add it in the cup is much better. And and honey. So the way I do it is please don't try this at home if you you know you're gonna burn yourself or something, you know. So the way I like to do it is like this. You're gonna take a strainer and you're just gonna pour, be very careful with pouring. Because I've, I've had a few incidents myself. You know. And. This is it hot. And. I, I like to put it in the pitcher. I like to put it in. Actually. Without the strainer actually. I like to pour it in the pitcher. And I like to add some more water. That way I can have it, you know, I can sometimes, you know, in the nighttime, you don't feel like heating nothing up. So you can add some more water, you know, let it sit in the refrigerator, drink it as iced tea or hot tea. Um, drink it at nighttime. My opinion, I think it's more effective hot, you know, because it, it burns the fat. But when it's cold, it's still good too. It's still good. But yeah, you could drink it hot or cold. Put it in your refrigerator. And that's it. Let me know if you have any questions. This, this, this does conclude the video. And you just drink it. Hold on. It's still a little hot. But... This is, it tastes very, 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 very good. It's a herbal good, you know. Not for the not for the mouth, but for the for the belly. It is very effective. But let me know if you have any questions. This concludes the video. If there's anything I missed, you know, let me know down in the comment section below. In the meantime, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so so much for watching. If you have any questions, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Leave your questions down in the comment section below, and I'll be sure to get back to you. Until my next video, I love y'all. Peace.